There's lots of lines and stuff. We don't know if we're supposed to be in one or not. But uh, it is a little confusing. A lot of people seem to know what they're doing, but not us. Yeah. Not us. We're, doing, we're gonna do a thing here. Welcome to this thing. Uh, HHNH, Halloween H Horror in Nights. Uh, our first time. We don't really know what we're doing, but we're here. We're gonna do it. Jessica is? Scared. Scared. I'm a little scared, but not really. Just nervous because I don't, I don't want to miss anything, and we want to do a good job here at this thing. I think it's gonna be neat. So let's uh, figure out how to do this. <laughs> we did not do any research or anything, but maybe this will help you in the we're future. But there's people the here like staying, staying in line already. I think for some, you, you know, areas. You um, I think we're by Dueling Dragons. I don't know. We're back by this area. We did opt for the express passes because this is probably going to be our only night here. I still don't know what we're doing. Hopefully we'll make the best of it and get our money's worth. In any case, we're going to have a good time and we're going to show you what we experience as noobs. Anyways, we might do this mummy thing. So I think we're going to go in here. All right, some things are happening now. We are actually moving. I think we're going back to a house. I think we're doing Last of Us first. We're gonna tell you about it. We were in a holding zone. I'll give you an update here just a bit, just about uh, what we were doing, what we experienced, and the confusion that we kind of ran into. I don't know. I still don't know what I'm doing really, but you know, we're just doing this thing. Looks like we walked through a lot of, a lot of line here. The Last of Us. What are we doing? All right, so I guess we're about to go in. So I'm gonna put you guys away and I'll talk to you. We'll talk to you when we get out and we're done. We'll give you uh, our thoughts. Okay, bye. All right, so we made it out of The Last of Us and that was actually, it was very fun. The air conditioning was very nice inside of that house. I really like the sounds. There's lots of different sounds that you can hear and things to listen to like the creatures and whatever you want to call them and the people yelling and it was very dark, I will say that. It was extremely dark, so some of the things were kind of hard to see. It was very fun. Uh, definitely enjoyed it. That was our first house ever. And you go single file line, I guess that's a normal thing. I didn't know that, but I just want to tell you what I found out that I didn't know of before. Next up, we're going into the Monsters Unmasked. Sounds pretty cool, because it's going to be a bunch of like classic monsters, like Frankenstein, Dracula, and Wolverine. Wolverine, no, not Wolverine, Wolfman. <laughs> Ah, uh, that's over maybe on the other side. It's not even dark. So we we got the express thing and we like just walked right in. So I don't even know. Is that what to expect the whole night? We'll find out, we'll let you know. Went right in, did it, got spooked, came out, went out of the exit, went back into this next line for this next house and we'll go from there. All right, so what'd you think of the uh, Monsters Unmasked That was house? scarier than the last of us. That was yeah. Yeah, that was much scarier. That was much better. They scared you from beginning to literally to the end. Just before you step out of the door, you're yeah. still getting spooked. That was amazing. Like the music, the sound, the effects, the lighting. I really enjoyed that. Monsters Unmasked. That's a big thumbs up. They are? Yeah? You're there? All right. Yes. Yeah, we liked it. It is 6.13, I think. Officially, this thing opened at what, six o'clock? We've already done two houses. Whatever we're doing is working so far. I don't know, you'll have to go back to the uh, the video and see what the heck we're doing. Seems like we're doing all right time-wise. So yeah, I'm, I'm excited and I feel good about everything. It's not even dark yet. Look at that. We definitely uh, had to, to quench our thirst from all the screaming. We opted, I opted for this uh, lacto cooler. This is like a sour. It's actually, it's really good. I really like this thing. It seems like it matches like for the uh, Halloween Horror Nights type of vibe. And then Jessica got this um, Original Sin Crimson Chaos Cider. It makes me think of milk. Lacto, lactose, right? Lacto cooler. But it's, I don't think there's any milk in it. But. That would be weird. It's kind of weird, like walking through here when it's, I mean, it's Halloween Horror Nights, but it's not really night. So it's not as spooky, but they got the spooky music playing. When we're going through like the Simpsons area, where usually it's like But not, not now. So we've done two houses. We've done The Last of Us and we've done Monsters Unmasked. And now it's time for this Darkest Deal thing. What is this? What is Darkest Deal? I don't know. I'm assuming this is gonna be some sort of deal with the devil, maybe like a musical thing, like the blues, like there's a, there's, you know, there's a lot of history with the blues, guys having deals with the devil, the crossroads and all that stuff so they can play some sweet, 
some sweet riffs and whatnot that everybody loves. Oh, oh, Grand Circus. Are we going in the Grand Circus? Oh, I don't know what we're doing. All right, I'm getting out of here. We'll see you guys later. All right, so JR, what do you think about that one? That was pretty good. I like the blues one. I, I asked you and then I started answering. That's rude of me. So anyways, how'd you like it? It was good. It was scary. Um, some, <laughs> some lady behind me was... Uh, it's your mom. Almost. But yeah, that was a good one. I enjoyed it. I liked the music. Uh, the music aspect of it, right? So it's like the, the blues guy that sells his soul so he can be the ultimate guitar player, play some sweet, like, sweet solos or whatever. So... He did do that, he did give up his soul, and um, you know, there were some things happening. See here, there's Bub's Lounge, Barrel House Blues. Yeah, yeah, I did like the vibe here. I thought it was really cool. Yeah. And the vibe, and the music playing, and the guy, how he was moving. I can't move like that guy. But well, I mean, because he was being dealt by the me devil. Of like, I don't know, it gave me like New Orleans kind of vibe. Yeah. But I don't know anything about any of the houses, so it could be, you know, the story could be bad. I mean, yeah. Yeah, it was like, you know, it's like that traditional, like, blues deal blues. where the guy's, yeah. like, selling his soul to the devil so he can be the ultimate, like, guitar dude or whatever. So that's that's what it was, and it was fun. I enjoyed it. What's next? I wish it would be dark already. That would be kind of cool. Halloween Horror Nights, not, not Halloween dark. Horror Afternoons. I'm cool with it not being dark. It is nice being here in the afternoon um, because afternoons are usually really nice looking. Like the skies are really cool here in Florida in the afternoons, evenings. So, I mean, that's kind of nice. All right, here's what we got. We got Dr. Oddfellow's Twisted Origins, 7, oh, 706. <laughs> And we're on our, what, fourth house? No, fifth house. Is this the fifth one? Yeah, oh yeah. I thought that was Is this the fifth one? No, 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 no. Is this the fifth it one? Is this is the fourth one. Okay, so anyways, seven o'clock, we're on our fourth house of ten. Oh, we're totally going to be able to get all these, I think. Boy, there's a lot of people. But that last house was very fun. That was the Dr. Oddfellows. I hate clowns. Oh, you hate clowns. How many clowns did you see in there? Too many. There really wasn't that many clowns in there. And it was dark, so you couldn't even really tell. It's just like somebody screaming. It may not have been a clown. Might have been a demon. Still, this guy is pretty. I think we're gonna go do this nightmare fuel show. It's supposed to be like scantily clad ladies with magic stuff. All right, we're gonna do this nightmare fuel show. Let's see some magic. Wow, wow, what a show. JR, what a show. That was scary. That was so scary. That was so scary. That was a good show. That, that was a good show. Okay, all you guys. What? What do you mean? Yeah, I thought it was enjoyable. JR enjoyed it. <laughs> Who doesn't like a good magic show? Yeah. It's dark now, so that's kind of cool. So now it's Halloween Horror Nights, not just Halloween Horror Afternoons. Now let's get spooked. I think we're going to go into the Harry Potter town. Maybe we can see some Death Eaters. Oh, there's the Death Eaters. There they are. What are they doing? They're eating death. Those guys are eating death. Wow. were pretty dang cool. Pretty good. Uh, they were like walking around and uh, you know, like doing battles with people. They were battling real people. So wizards, real people, wizards, wizard people. They were battling them, losing, by the way. I don't know what else to call it, but it was just really cool. I enjoyed that. That was neat. 
Death Eaters are fun. That never gets old there. A dragon. Man, look at all the fog and smoke. Uh oh, what are we doing? Oh, I think we're gonna ride Gringotts. I think. So we've done a few houses, that's been really fun. But the scare zones, we haven't done a single scare zone yet. But I think we're about to do one. Maybe. Okay, yeah, I think this is this is legit our first scare zone. There's a scary truck. Oh, that was a scary thing that went by. Oh, look at that person. And there's some stuff in there. Scary stuff. Smoke. Oh. oh, wow. Do you see that? Holy moly. Oh, wow. Look at this bat person. And a, oh, oh, whoa. Can we take a picture? Oh, yeah, look at it. Oh, 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 they're eating. There we go. I think we made it through the scare zone. Only slightly scared, so that was pretty fun. Oh yeah, here we go. We the old Chucky's Ultimate Kill Count. That's what this one, that sounds fun. This express thing has been working out pretty well because this particular house was like a 80 minute wait. I bet we'll wait maybe 15 minutes, maybe, max. All right, so Chucky's Kill Count. JR, what do you think of Chucky's Kill Count? There was a lot of kills. There were a lot of kills in there. I seen, it seemed like there was a lot of, of death. I was, it's like two different houses in one. Yeah, it was the pretty good. Show. I enjoyed that. That was a good one. It was a lot of high energy in the Chucky one. And uh, it was pretty gory. So that was kind of neat. Yeah, there was a lot of blood. A lot yeah. of guts. Well, blood and guts. You gotta get splashed by something. Me and mom did. No spoilers. But just so you know, there might be a little bit of death and I got sprayed with blood. I do like all the lights everywhere. It's kind of cool. All the lighting and whatnot. Oh, look at that. Chucky's killer treats. I wonder what's in there. Hmm. Ooh, this looks cool. We're going through another scare zone. I think it's this Vamp 69. I think it's what this scare zone is. Seems pretty neat and cool. Oh. Oh, oh. oh, there's people walking around with heads. That's pretty weird. Oh. Oh, smoke. Whoa. Wow. Are you, are you amazed? Yeah. Oh, look. Oh, boy. He's going crazy. Next up, we're doing Yeti, Yeti, Yeti Campground Kills. All right, so Yeti was very fun. That was a very fun house. Not really scary. Not scary. Not scary. Oh, it, it was scary. Sorry. Stayar says it's scary. So maybe it was kind of scary. Expedition Everest won't be the same after that one. We're having a lot of fun. It's the first time we ever done this. We didn't we didn't know what we were doing. We still don't know what we're doing. Everything is working out just fine. And uh, yeah, I, I'm having a good time. All right, so we're gonna do this one next. This is Dueling Dragons, Choose Thy Faith. We're being told we have to do this one twice because there's two different things to do here. Never mind, we're just gonna do it once. At first, I thought that sign was a, it was wrong because it says Horror Nights 23 when this is actually Halloween Horror Nights 32. But actually that just means Halloween Horror Nights 2023. Or does it? Don't they do a lot of secret little, what do you call them? Snippets, <laughs> hidden whatevers. Maybe that's what that is. I don't know. But oh my gosh, look at all the people. <laughs> well, there's a lot of people here. So 
uh, what's your verdict on dueling dragons? They're all scary and yeah. The man, that wasn't that scary. Yeah, Yeti was worse. Yeti was kind of scary. Yeah. But dueling dragons wasn't really scary. It was just kind of cool walking through there. I mean, we won. We chose ice was our fate. We chose wisely. So yeah, Stranger Things is next. We gotta go into Jimmy Fallon, I guess, to go to Stranger Things. We just got out of uh, the Exorcist house. That was a, a rambunctious house. That was a rambunctious house. There was some scary stuff in there. Yeah, we did that in, what was the one we did just before that? Stranger Things. Stranger Things, oh yeah. Stranger Things, that was your favorite, right? Yes. Yeah, Stranger Things was, it was really good. All right, anyways, we're gonna go to this house to the right, Blood Moon, final one. It's gonna be epic and awesome. And then we can start doing some uh, food and some scare zones.
up to light. Oh, the chicken. Oh, I'm not even paying attention. Most Dr. Oddfellow.